Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As promised, uh, I'm gonna show you uh, this my new bug out bag. Maybe let's call it a review. I'm just gonna show you in details everything I find interesting and my bug out bag. It says here this is a USMC logo. Uh, Semper Fidelis, which basically means like always faithful in Latin USMC. It's kind of gimmicky to make it a better seller, but I don't mind uh, if there's actually a kind of bug out scenario and stuff like that. I would discuss this and make it look civilian as much as possible, but I think there won't be a bug out situations and I'm not gonna bug out too much and that's why I like it so I like the color as well uh, I think that the better color for actual bugging out is black but you cannot beat this I love this color just uh, nice and cool and when you have a black bag uh, when it gets dirty uh, just a little bit it shows and tells and can fade and this one I uh, had uh, this color of bags before and they are just long lasting regarding regarding with that so start off here we have some Molly attachments sorry about the kick two rows uh, and over here you have a place to put your name in it like this little piece of paper and you can use this for something else and what I like down there you have a nice large deep pocket so that's very nice and also uh, over here you have another large pocket and you see it has a waterproofing a plasticated isolation and this part here is not bad I like it so it should uh, hold against the rain at least the zippers are plastic and but I had many zippers like this and I never had an issue with them so if you don't put too much strain on them they will work so we have one two pockets and you have another one which is very nice I just love this so many pockets here in this bag so first you have year one and you have this like velcro part uh, you have one pocket here and one pocket here and one smaller and another one for me for like a pen or for something good for flashlight so here here I just hold pockets I think all guys hold pockets so I really like this setup and it's very well thought through and thought of. Very nice. And by the way, this is a, I'll put it in the, in, the, in the title of this video, but here you have another a large zipper and you have two of the zippers. So if you wanna, you can open it. you have more pockets in here so that's that's perfect for me so you have one here uh, you already have one two three four zippers and you have here lots of space and storage area uh, I think that this kind of bags are just super superior to the ones of sports bags uh, you don't have to use it intentionally for bugging out I will I will probably use this bag for um, when I go to the seaside or something else it's just ideal you know, for camping so so much pockets so much good space here you all open here you have pockets again and a little d-ring to attach something uh, and this other side uh, to Two smaller holes for pockets but you can stand and this is a bag overall it's not a small bag I saw online you have uh, $20 uh, bag out bags uh, 
from China, but uh, reading the reviews, I almost bought one, but reading the reviews, everyone was surprised how small they are. Now this one is just a decent size, it's not too big, it's not too small. We have here three little pockets, another pocket for a pen or flashlight, and a bit larger pocket, pocket. and this is, has a double stitching, uh, double, double layers, two layers of material, so it's a fat one. And when you fill all these pockets here and here, you can still toss something inside of it. So I really, really uh, like it. And this is uh, this kind of style of bag and backpack. If you need it for, for every day, if you're a person who wears a backpack, I wear a messenger bag, but uh, nevertheless, this is something very nice. And on the sides here, uh, you have this little safety feature, this locks. So if you stuff too much stuff in it, uh, this will uh, save your zippers. Uh, and you can make this even larger with this one. So it's very well thought of back. So, over here you have a little carabiner that says bug out gear on it so I think that's cool so I like it you have a little attachments part here and here and this is just very sturdy um, and again I'm not saying this because uh, nobody sent me this bag to review or I buy everything on myself so this is very sturdy I could hang on this it's all double stitched and I could hang a lot of stuff right here and just open it and on the other sides of course you have more of this and this is like the main compartment so if you have some large items uh, you want to put in there some clothes I'm not sure can you put a laptop I think you could I think you could but there is no dedicated uh, laptop bag so this is made to be a bug out or a camping outdoors gear but again I'm saying uh, this can be wonderful uh, bag backpack for uh, people who are using it and here you have again that a layer of waterproofing and I'm not sure how long this will last because I think this is a plasticky plastic so uh, in some of the bags after I use it tends to peel off but if that something like that happens I will make an update video and here you have a nice storage area you have here reinforced um, bottom uh, so it's a double bottom reinforced and here you have another pocket it's a large pocket all the way to the bottom and of course you have a logo well, this is the brand of the back Piper gear and you have here a uh, little stitch pipergear.com uh, and when I I entered this address, it took me to the Sandpiper California, I think, uh, page. So I'm not sure what's up with that. Uh, that brings us uh, to the outer parts of the bag. So on the back side uh, and on the back of the bag, you have a reinforced material and you have some kind of probably foamy stuff so it's very comfortable over here you have you have attached this little weather stuff and you can put your address and name in it I'm not sure if this comes for all of them but mine has it and has a nice handle and handle is one of these sturdiest handles I ever had in here and this is something I never really encountered before but Velcro and now I'm curious what's inside nothing 
I always love hidden compartments. There's nothing in here, but it's, it's kind of Velcro. But nevertheless, I just want to give up. It's very comfortable when you wear it on your shoulders. It straps nice. Uh, these have multiple D rings here, and and, and on the inside you have very comfortable I think this is not a real leather I think this is a rubber or plastic but uh, it's very comfortable and I like the idea that this is not uh, the same material as this because I tend to sweat a lot especially in the summer and especially when you're wearing something like this so I prefer when this is uh, just waterproof and can sweat can just go off of this otherwise uh, the handles, uh, what you call this, would be soaking in the sweat and during the time it will produce an odor it will smell badly so other than that uh, you have here this little attachment in the front so you can hook this up and all this is very strong uh, the um, material is Cordura at 600 10 years so that's something what you after and it's very it's very sturdy a little carabiner here and like I said before the bottom is reinforced uh, and you have double stitching all over the places and I think it's a very uh, decent bug out bag. It's not top of the line. It's not something that uh, you're gonna pay 100 bucks also. So uh, for the money, uh, around 50 or 60 is bucks. Uh, I think you're getting decent bag, uh, but I don't know. Uh, it's up to you for decide for yourself. I like it uh, and. I'm very happy with it so uh, now I did a review I'm gonna use it I'm gonna s I wanna make a bug out bag so that's why I bought this but I really like it so uh, maybe in the summer if I go somewhere camping or to the seaside which is more likable I like seaside uh, I will take this with me because it has a tons of pockets and so it has a multiple uses uh, it can definitely be a good bug out bag it's very comfortable and has that army look but can be a nice commuter bag because it's not huge it's not overly huge just like a uh, champion's backpack or something else but a bit bigger and when when it's not full uh, you can see it's very it's not that flat and it looks nice I uh, love the color and can be great commuter bag as well and for a student for a college student and for someone else uh, carry on stuff and it's very sturdy very good and I like it so uh, that's it uh, thank you all for watching this was my little review of Piper bag or my bug out bag backpack uh, and thank you for watching uh, I'm gonna start filling up this uh, with some bug out essential gear and have a lots of fun with it. So I'm EDC Gunner and hope you guys have a nice rest of the day.